Guys, Wisteria Moon here, and today I have a quickie little video for you all. We're gonna be doing a bunch of snazzical stuff, but first of all, let me go ahead and open up my Jamaliday gift calendar. Oh, would you look at that? We've got a masterpiece token. That is some radical stuff. Not really sure if uh, this is gonna be the most uh, useful thing for me because I already have a membership, so you know, that's cool. But maybe I'll trade it to a non member friend. Maybe I will be giving it away. Also, taking this look right here, legit army fan. That is some spicy stuff. But, anyways, guys, so today I am basically going to be going over some very radical Animal Jam updates for you all, even though today is Friday, so I'm a little late to the parade, but that's all right. Um, also, I apologize if the audio quality is subpar. I do not have my microphone with me currently, so you might hear some laptop overheating. Hopefully, you all are okay with that. It's gonna be a good old throwback to the old days of my terrible recording quality. But anyways, before we get into it, I just have a quick little announcement. So many of you are aware that I currently have a merch store, which you can access by visiting www.wisteriaworld.com. So if you scroll all the way down to the very bottom of the page and click on this merch button. At the very top you will see this button that says Snazical Holiday Sale. So go ahead and give that a good old click and check out these amazing sales that we have going on because guess what jammers? They end tonight. That is right. The biggest Wisteria Moon merch sale of the season ends tonight as in December 15th, 2017 at 1159 p.m. Eastern Time. And once again this is probably the biggest sale that we'll be having this year so you do not want to miss it. Be sure to get your Snazical Wisteria Moon merch in time for the holidays. I will be including the link to this page at the top of the description of this video. In addition to that, be sure to stick around till the very end of this video because at the end of this video I'm going to be announcing some giveaway winners that I held in previous videos as well as hosting a new giveaway that you all can enter in the comments of this video. So that'll be some very spicy stuff. But without further ado, let us hop into the Jamma journal because it's been a while since I've been on Animal Jam. I've had college finals to deal with and I'm very excited to see these new updates that have come around. So on the first page we have the mystery continues. Ooh, that is some ominous stuff. <laughs> wow, what a, what a beautiful little uh, crystal right there. You can see that lemur is very, very entranced. Following the mystery below, the Elphus, Grimm, and Cosmo helped recover the strange stone that had been sealed away inside the sunken city discovered in the adventure, and they have brought the stone to the Alpha headquarters for further study and observation. Ooh, well that is some spicy stuff. Not even the Alphas have seen anything like it. All across Jama, the same question is on everyone's minds. What is it? You know what, Animal Jam? That is indeed a great question. What even in the heck is that thing? It looks like a conglomeration of unicorn colors. It's got that nice pastel aesthetic. But literally, that is some insane stuff. I honestly have no clue as to what it might be. But one thing we can do is hop on over to the Alpha headquarters and check it out at the end of our little Jama journal reading session. But for now, let's head on over to the next page and see what else we've got. So right here we've got more mannequins. Ooh, that is some spiciness. New mannequins are being rolled out. Oh yes, squad rollout. Heck yeah. Keep an eye on the mannequin in the left side of the diamond shop for more of these stunning new den items. Mannequins are also being improved all the time and jammers can now move accessories from one mannequin to the other without having to take them off first. There's never been a better time to pick up mannequins. Well guys, this is definitely an exciting new addition. I know a lot of people uh, complain about the mannequins initially because there were not enough animal types available, but now it appears as though Animal Jam is adding some more diverse mannequins to the store, so that'll be pretty fun. Of course, pretty sure they're all going to be members still. That is the unfortunate, unfortunate reality. But before I assume the worst, we're going to have to check it out firsthand after the rest of this Jamal journal reading. So here on the next page, we have daily Jamaliday gifts. The Jamaladays are still going. There's still fun to be had. There are still daily diamonds and gifts, whether you have been good or bad. Oh, well, that is quite nice because I've been a very bad jammer so far this year, guys. Very, very naughty. But Animal Jam still loafs me, so that is pretty sweet. I'm gonna be picking up my daily Jamaliday gifts from now on, or at least trying to. I've already missed about two thirds of them. I'm a complete failure. That's okay, though. So stop by every day, spread some Jamaliday cheer, for these gifts come only when the Jamaladays are here. Here. It is much of an honor, Animal Jam. Thank you for all these daily gifts, some real sniziness, but let's head on over to the next page. So here we have New Year's Party. Ooh, jammers everywhere are getting ready to bid 2017 goodbye, and there's no better place to celebrate the arrival of 2018 than the New Year's Party. Ooh. So uh, New Year's Party is a very, very exciting event for me. I do think it's a bit early to introduce it, considering New Year's is still about uh, two weeks away, but that's all right. Animal Jam's being, uh, being a little preemptive. Nothing wrong with that. And then on the next side, we have Sketch Jam. Oh, yeah. Yes, sketch jams are personal favorite series of mine. Click the art studio in Coral Canyons or click above to see a new sketch jam video featuring one of AJHQ's artists. Should I click it, guys? Should I click it? All right, maybe we'll give it a give it a quick shot. Mm, that high quality graphic though. Oh man, look at that art in action. Ah, that sad moment when this sketch is way better than anything I could do already. It would take me about 20 hours to be able to pull off something this great. What the heck? Snowy. Oh my goodness, guys. I think that this sketch jam might indeed have been done by Snowy Claw, a fellow Animal Jam YouTuber. Oh, and then that one. 
<laughs> that one just literally pops out of nowhere. It's just like, bam! All of a sudden, AJHQ just stamps their little guy down there in the corner. But anyways, let's head on over to the next page. So here we have snowshoes. Oh my gosh. Reports are coming in that jammers have been spotting horseshoe prints in the snow around Jamal. Everyone knows that horses love to play in the snow, but these prints are much bigger than the hooves of horses in Jamal. Where could these prints have come from? Is it some sort of winter prank? People keep you posted as we learn more. <gasps> well guys, you know, this can only mean one thing, and that is that someone's playing some intense games of horseshoe. No, JK. Nope, guys, I think we have none other than a brand new Animal Jam animal on the way. Of course, I'm not really sure what kind of animal this could be because <laughs> what other animal besides horses wears horseshoes? I don't know, maybe it's like a moose or something. Maybe Animal Jam's throwing a curveball over here. I would be very excited to see it being like a Clydesdale or something like that, like a, just a giant horse, you know, that would be pretty fun. But I don't know. I honestly have no idea. But I'm gonna have you guys guess for me at the end of this video, so stick around, if you will. And then on the final page, we have AJ stocking stuffers. Ooh, quite the loafly idea. Stuff your stockings with adorable Animal Jam cheer, plushies, and pets, and candy, and cards. They can all be found at your local Walmart and Target stores. Well, guys, you know how it is. I'm gonna have to be uh, hitting up my local Walmart and Target. It's time to buy some Animal Jam stocking stuffers for myself, of course. No, JK. No, guys, I actually do think it would be pretty fun to buy some Animal Jam stocking stuffers. Maybe I'll do a little video of that. Maybe I'll spread some AJH here by doing a Animal Jam stocking giveaway. That would be a fun idea, hopefully, but from what I can see, that concludes this little Animal Jam update. Yeah, so I guess it wasn't uh, too revolutionary, but that's okay. We're gonna be making the most of it. So, first of all, let us go ahead and check out this brand new feature in the Alpha Headquarters, which is this strange, mysterious stone that has been recovered by the Alphas. So, they plopped it right smack dab in the center of the Alpha Headquarters. Let's go ahead and give it a click. Strange stone. <laughs> What a creative name, guys. Strange Stone. Yep, that is a high, high quality name. Oh man, oh man. I guess Peck didn't name this one. It was probably like Sir Gilbert or something. Found among the ruins of a sunken city deep beneath Jamaa's surface, this strange stone is unlike anything the Alphas have ever seen. Until they can learn more about it, they are keeping it safely stored in Alpha Headquarters. Well, I don't know how safe this storage is. I mean, there are no guards around. Um, pretty much seems to be out in the open. Anyone could pretty much pick it up. And it also seems pretty dangerous to have some weird, uh, weird unidentified crystal in the middle of the place, but you know, that's it's all right. Guess, guess they're taking some real risks, guys. Taking some top-notch risks. But it looks as though there's nothing else to observe here, so we're gonna be heading on over to the diamond shop next door and checking out what new mannequins have arrived. So let's uh, click this mannequin button on the left. As you can see here, we have our llama mannequin, as well as some other amazing new varieties. The panda, fox, the seal, which is just beautiful, beautiful stuff. Guess we're gonna be getting this and testing it out. Can't even remember which ones are new and which ones are old, to be honest with you guys. Oh man, the, the overheating is real guys. I apologize for this terrible quality. I'm gonna have to lock my den so that it won't overheat even more from all the people in there. R.I.P. Fans are I.P. Anyways, let's pop our mannequins over here. They're gonna be uh, BFFs. We'll go ahead and click on this. Let's dress it up with some ice armor. Test this feature out. There we have our ice armor look and now we can move the items from one mannequin to the other. Now that is what I call convenience. So yes, the new mannequins are definitely a plus. Of course, there are still no non-member mannequins. What the heck, Animal Jam? Trying to make my life inconvenient? Gosh, you'd think no members were playing this game for free or something. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, be not members. No, but uh, in all seriousness, I understand that Animal Jam has to reserve some features for only members, but who knows? Maybe someday not members will be able to partake in the fun a little bit. Of course, we've already obtained our daily Jamaliday gift, and unfortunately, the New Year's party is nowhere in sight. I am not even entirely sure if it is going on right now. It appears as though we don't really have any intricate party options at the moment, except for this call of the Alphas type of deal, which I haven't actually been to in a while, but you know, it's kind of old news. No, JK. I don't have time for this right now. We gotta be dedicated, guys. Dedicated. So I guess besides the New Year's party, all we have is this strange new animals feature and these stocking stuffers. Wow, what a, what a remarkable update. Well, since there's not much else to see here, what I can do is investigate some of the new Jamaliday items. First thing I'm gonna be switching over to my gingerbread house den. Only the remnants of my decorations are still up. So I'm actually gonna be purchasing some new Jamaliday items, like these candy cane candles. Oh, would you look at that? We got some black striped candles. R.I.P. to all those jammers who refreshed their Jamaliday calendar about 50,000 times to try to get those rare black striped candy cane socks. <laughs> that would be a frustrating scenario. I would give up in the first five refreshes, but you know, give you all credit. Credit for your persistence. I'm loafing these poinsettias. These are beautiful. And same with these Jamaliday street lanterns. These are hecking amazing. Oh yes, I'm gonna be putting those all over the place too. Same with the gifts. Cannot have enough presents, guys. Gonna be very greedy jammers today. Gonna add our clock in there too. Ooh, in our mailbox. Got a pet Jamaliday tree, which is uh, interesting. 
and stuff. At this point, I'm honestly just buying everything. Like, this this is ridiculous. I have no chill today. Buy some snow trees. They actually have a lot of items this time around. Upside down Jamaladay tree. Okay, I don't know who the heck would want that, but, you know, that's cool. I'm gonna buy some ornaments. Blowing some cash today, guys. There we have our epic Jamaladay tree. Gonna get some food in there, too. Some wood piles, because why not? And, yeah, I'm liking this so far. Um, let's check out the diamond shop, too. Oh, we got some popping stuff in here. Oh, literally just this gingerbread tree house. How riveting. Oh, at least we can get some candy trees. That's pretty adorable. You know what? We might as well just start from scratch. Stun is just disappointment. And now I'm glitching out. Oh, I should have known better. Then to search for popcorn. Big, big mistake, folks. Mmm. Loving this frame rate. Oh, yes. I think we're going at a rate of about a quarter of a frame per second. That is amazing. On the bright side, my uh, computer has stopped overheating, so there's always that. Alrighty, guys. So here we have it. My top-notch, heavily oversaturated, winterized Jamalady den. You know, it, it needs a lot of work, but I think the bones are there. I might uh, dedicate some time to fixing it up a bit, making it a top quality den. But realistically, they're just gonna need to add some more Jamalady items for it to be looking truly snazzy. But hopefully you all appreciate my efforts gonna be uh, adding some some Jamaladay spirit to my croc without compromising this beautiful candle aesthetic. Yes, that sweater. That sweater is beautiful. Hopefully you all enjoy this a little Jamaladay winterization slash Jamaladization session. I worked real hard for it, alright? But anyways, this pretty much concludes the update portion of the video because this was not a truly eventful Animal Jam update, but that's alright. I got to investigate some of the new features that Animal Jam has added. So now, without further ado, do, let's move into the portion that you've all been patiently awaiting, which is the giveaway portion of the video. Alrighty guys, so the last giveaway was held in this recent video of mine called Not Sure How to Feel About This Animal Jam Member Bundle. And as you can see here, that giveaway was for a long blue rare spiked collar. So all people had to do to enter the giveaway was comment below on that video their Animal Jam username and their favorite part about the Jamaladays. And they also, of course, had to leave a like on the video and subscribe to my channel. So the winner that was selected successfully did all these things. And here they are folks, Dobie's 10. So without further ado, let me go ahead and search this player up. There they are, rocking that ice armor. And now let us search up this long blue rare spiked collar, attach the gift, and we'll say congrats. Woo! And apply this adorable little Jamaladay jamagram. And scent. Ah, the feeling of giving and becoming poorer. <laughs> you know what guys, one day I'm gonna run out of spikes, but it'll be well worth it. So anyways, the next giveaway is going to be for two items. That is right guys, not one, but two. And so those are this long orange rare spiked collar and this masterpiece token. So basically allow members and non-members to make masterpieces for free. So that is some pretty fun stuff. Now, in order to enter this giveaway, all you must do is comment below on this video your Animal Jam username and what you think the new animal will be. Also, you must be subscribed to my channel and leave a like on this video. I do check, so be sure that you do those things. So anyways, guys, I guess that officially wraps it up for this little Animal Jam update video. I really hope that you all enjoyed it. I'm gonna be trying to get back on the video grind for you all. So be sure to stay tuned, stay active, because more giveaways are coming your way. And yeah, but that, as always, thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!